Hey everybody, it's Steven here with Scott Free Racing. Unfortunately, we're not racing today due to the weather conditions. As you can see in the background, it's really windy down here and they made a safety call to shut it down. We are going to give you an inside look at the cockpit today, so come follow me. Alrighty, now we're inside the cockpit. I'm going to show you kind of the roles that me and my dad have. Uh, first off, we're in the driver's seat. This is my seat and uh, this is where I pretty much steer the boat and get it around the course. Um, Right here on the dash, we'll just start off with some of the main things that I use right here on this display. This is my rear view camera. This is where I can see are the boats behind me um, so I can know if I'm clear to go inside and out of the turns and um, basically just make sure I can see what the competition is behind me. Um, on this display right here, this is gonna tell us what our speeds are and also the distances that we're traveling throughout the race. Um, it kind of helps us know, you know how far along we are through the race. We can tell by the, the total distance. On this side of the cockpit, it's pretty simple. Uh, obviously, I got my steering wheel, that's how I drive the boat. And then I got my lap counter over here, which is pretty uh, simple. I just pull a piece of tape every time we make the lap. And um, down here, I have my scuba tank. Um, in case the worst does happen, we have uh, oxygen. In All right, now we're on my dad's side of the boat. Um, this is where a lot of the major things happen inside a race. Um, a lot of important roles go on with the throttle man, and I'll help you explain everything that goes on. Uh, first off, he's got his main controls here. He's got a shifter and his throttle, pretty much all our electri electrical switches, um, ignition start, blowers, bilge pump, um, emergency shutoff switches, anything we need to do um, inside the boat. We have our entire switch panel up top here. He's got all his gauges. It tells him what the motor's doing, um, making sure everything's running at peak performance during the race. And if he needs to make any changes or whatnot, he can tell by the gauges. Um, the indicator levers here on the top of the dash tell him what his trim tabs and drive are doing. He's constantly making changes to the trim tabs and drive during the race to help keep the boat in control or whether he needs to tighten it up or loosen it up. Across the dash right here, this lever right here, this is his ballast fill. Um, if we feel like that we need more water in the bow of the boat to uh, help the boat be more level, he'll, lower, he'll push this down. That'll be pumping water into the front of the boat. Um, and then he pulls it back and that uh, stops filling the bow up with water. Now, if we need to get the water out of the bow, we push this toggle switch right here and this will pump water out of the bow to get the weight we just uh, pumped in out. So lower the trim tabs or raise the trim tabs. He's using these two white buttons right here. The red button controls the out drive. But mainly those are all the main functions of the boat. Uh, like I said, the driver and throttleman are very important. Communication is very important. Um, you got to work well together and me and my dad do very well at that. Um, but these are all the instruments we had to work with during a race. I uh, hope you enjoy the tour and we will see you on Friday for race day one.